If only 2020 were as predictable as the Dollywood Express schedule. <laughs> you have to germex to get on a ride, off a ride. It's all aboard for the Hazelwood family. I'm just grateful. Grateful for people like Jane Ray. Walk right up there, they'll, they'll wait for you. She left her job as a paralegal to work for Dollywood. That was 21 years ago. Well, I, I love it here. I can't imagine now working any other place. It was a dream until COVID derailed her plans this year. The park was supposed to open for the season in March, but that didn't happen. But we know that was the right decision. Dolly was here. She was in on the conversation. She felt that it was more important to make sure folks were safe. In a small tourist town like Pigeon Forge, places like Dollywood make up 21% of gross revenue. Amusements alone are credited with bringing in $315 million in 2019. That, by the way, was a record year for Dollywood, and Pete Owen says momentum had been growing until the virus stopped it in its tracks. The park reopened in June. We really relied on research and what the experts were telling us to do the right thing. Call it half speed ahead. Indoor entertainment venues like theaters are closed. Shops, restaurants, and rides are open. It's all part of more than 700 operational changes made to get this place back on track. Consumer research is the driving force. They want to make sure that they know that they're going to be safe or they were going to, they're going to feel as if they are safe. Of the more than 600 employees laid off, we're told almost all have their jobs back now. All I can think of is I'm home, I'm home, I'm home again. Jane is celebrating. Yes, I am. No better place to be. Another birthday at work. 72 years old. By welcoming those who need the stop off here most. Like the Hazelwoods. Dad is a respiratory therapist in North Carolina working with COVID patients. It's nice that I can actually take the family out and not have to worry as much about all this. From financial to economic to personal. And I got on the loop-de-loop -loop one. This year has had some loop-de-loops. Still, life tends to keep barreling ahead just like that train. Like the rest of us, no matter what's coming, Dollywood will keep chugging along.